I almost got scammed. So I'm going to explain what happened. What I now, mind you, I do watch like Trilogy Media on YouTube and Scammer Payback on, on YouTube to explain what to look out for. And I'm usually very vigilant and I watch my uh, accounts and stuff very closely. Credit Karma and I have some other apps and I watch my accounts. But this one went completely under the radar until I got a letter saying that the account was closed. And looking at the dates and everything, I think I figured out what happened. So. For starters, I got this letter saying this account, such and such, was closed on April 10th, 2023. So I'm like, I did not open any accounts. What's going on here? So I called the bank, the branch, and asked them what's going on here. So they gave me more information. Yes, the account was open on March 9th, 2023, and closed on April 2010th because you have to be there at the branch in person to verify a few things and fill out some paperwork and that was never done so the account was closed the account was opened online so i'm like how did they get all my personal information and looking at the march 9th date i'm like wait a minute it was roughly the end, like end of december or beginning of march i started a application on indeed See, uh, the past couple months I've been trying to get a new job. So I was on, I made a resume on Indeed and I just started applying for jobs. So what I think happened is a scammer made a fake job listing on Indeed. And then when you send in your resume, it has all your personal information on it. So they probably took that personal information and opened this bank account, but their fraud prevention systems flagged it and closed the account. So I'm going to have to get some more security set up on my personal information like SafeLife and some other stuff, even though I already have NordVPN and some other stuff already in effect. But uh, keep a close eye on your accounts. Check out like Credit Karma. Make sure no accounts are open in your name. 